In today's SciRanch Arduino project, we will be making a smart trash can. After much frustration, I finally finished the code for this and got it working. I had plenty of setbacks and lots of issues, but let's continue. So first, we have to use the servo library to run the servo motor. Next, we create all of our variables. We make a position variable for the servo motor, a servo variable, the SIG pin, which is the input and output pin, of the ultrasonic sensor. And finally, we have a distances array. This is used to make sure that we are having a consistent reading out of the ultrasonic sensor. So there are no outliers in the readings. Now in the setup function, we attach the servo motor to pin nine and we write to it five degrees to turn it to five degrees. And then we wait one second just to let it sit for a little bit. Now we have to create two helper functions. One to convert from the measurement of time the ultrasonic sensor gives and we have to convert that to centimeters. The other one will update our distances array just to make sure we have no outliers in our data. Now we have this whole section in our loop and this entire section is where we do all of our reading data from the ultrasonic sensor. Now, in the servo section of this, we make sure there are no outliers by doing the math with all of the uh, data in the distances array. And we also check to make sure that the centimeter reading is less than 10 centimeters. Then we'll wait one second. We will write to the servo motor 90 degrees to open up the lid of the trash can. Then we'll wait five seconds or whatever is going to be five seconds for the Arduino. Since this, we're not using millis, it won't be exact. And then finally, we will write server to the server motor to go back to its five degrees, which will reset it.
If you enjoyed this video and like the idea of this channel, then please consider subscribing. I've linked to the TinkerCAD project and the Arduino code at the links below, and you can click them to view them. I've also added links to Amazon in case you want to buy the components for this project.